everyone, this is Kim Murphy, a seasoned web designer on ShootingInternet.com, going to make a quick demonstration video about Web Host Manager, also known as WHM, uh, which is the interface which, is, which handles multiple cPanel accounts. So you'll see here in my interface I have multiple cPanel icons, one for each account. So when you buy one individual hosting account, you're used to, or you may be used to cPanel. Web Host Manager is the interface that allows you to have hundreds, if not thousands, of hosting accounts all inside one system and manage them uh, flawlessly, quickly, easily, and conveniently. So, uh, the first place to go to to highlight the features of Web Host Manager, if you scroll down to List Accounts, let's see. Now the options you see on the left here won't always appear in your own web host manager system because my host reseller is giving me root access. So if you have root access, you're going to see all these things. I can have other resellers underneath me. But you might not have that. You might just see a few options on the left. But the one I want to show you is called list accounts. So you could have hundreds of accounts here. You can list them all on the same screen, like so. And you'll see I have about 100 here. And suppose you want to get inside one of these accounts and edit them. All you would have to do is find the account you want to edit, go to uh, cPanel. So when you click on the cPanel icon, you get the standard cPanel interface. And from cPanel, you could jump to different accounts. So it's a matter of managing hundreds of accounts from one single screen. And from here, you could back up the account, you create an FTP, view the use and so forth. But that's not what I'm trying to highlight today. What you want to do in your web host manager is look at some of the features. You can add a new account uh, quite easily. So suppose, for example, you want to create a new domain, a new www address, a new website in Web Host Manager. Just click on create a new account. Type in the domain. We could just say www. This is a test23.com and uh, generate a password. So in just a, a matter of a minute, you will see we have a new hosting account for one of our clients with a domain. And all we have to do is give this, and you'll see this, all we have to do is give this to your web designer or begin uploading files. And uh, whoops, just have to find the valid domain here. There we go. And you will see that in just a minute, maybe it took two minutes, you have a new hosting account for yourself, for your web designer, um, whoever you're dealing with. And you could just give them this account information here. And there's an FTP account ready to go with a username and a password all ready to go. And one more feature I want to show you, you can back up all your accounts right from Web Host Manager. So if you scroll down a little bit further in your functions here, uh, let's see here. So click on Backup Configuration and hit Enable. Now from here, you could back up all your cPanel accounts, your hosting accounts, um, flawlessly and you can make it automatically and you can see you can automate the backups automatically as well as you know create some um, settings here this is a matter of creating an FTP account hitting save and that's going to happen daily so thank you for watching my video I'm a seasoned web designer I do beautiful creative 
programming and professional websites. I'd be glad to answer any questions about Web Host Manager or cPanel. Um, and uh, thank you for watching my video.